Hello YouTube, my name is Dragonheart the Prince of Wales and welcome back to the Carded City career mode. Now like every episode or every other episode, I try to make it as interactive as possible. So what I want you guys to answer in the comment section below is what is your favourite football moment of, uh, of all time basically? Your favourite football moment of all time could be club football or international football. Now I'll reveal mine right here. My favourite moment of all time was back last year in 2016 when Wales obviously got to the semi-finals of the European Championships. It was absolutely amazing, especially that game against Belgium. The run they had, the game itself it was absolutely amazing. So, and as for a Welsh football fan that has been in the doldrums for many years, at some of the lowest lows, obviously the whole Gary Speed thing, the world rankings being 117th in the world, you know, barely able to defeat teams like Cyprus and then to to do what we did last year was absolutely amazing. Speaking of Wales. You can see something has happened here. First of all, transfer offer for Brian Murphy. I've actually um, negotiated this and I've been able to get myself up to £130,000 from Sheffield United, which we'll take. I did say previously that um, I wouldn't go for any international team unless it was Wales because New Zealand um, offered me a role before and I rejected it. Well, look what's happened. This early into the series... Prince Dragonheart, we would like to inquire about your interest and availability in managing the Wales national team. I'm just going to accept this, guys. I want to manage Wales. <laughs> I would love to be manager of Wales, so thank you so much. So that's the whole series taking a bit of a bizarre spin. Now, let's have a quick look at our fixtures because I want to simulate some games and obviously play others. And we're going to have some international football to show you in this series as well. Let me know what you think about me being manager of Wales, if you're happy about that, or if you want me to, to perhaps drop it. Maybe after a season I will drop it, or if we don't qualify or something. Uh, let's have a quick look at uh, the fixtures then. So, oh god, they've gone the wrong way, haven't I? Or well, have I gone the wrong way? I'm still again used to the interface, so to speak. Calendar, that's what I wanted. Right, we've got Fulham away. we got Preston North End away. We're back home with Sheffield Wednesday. And look at that, we've got the League Cup against Bristol. So I'm thinking, I'm actually thinking that we will play, I'm going to simulate and play some of these off camera. Fulham, Sheffield Wednesday and Preston. And when I come back, we will be having our matches against Bristol City and Sunderland. Okay guys, so don't go anywhere, they'll be the two games we will show. Oh, with that being said though, we've got Derby by here at home. That's the game I just attended as well in real life. And Leeds. Oh, I've got so many good games to pick here. Okay, Fulham, Sheffield Wednesday, and Preston. I am going to just play off camera. And these four games, or maybe the three, I might not show the Derby, but I'll show. I'll definitely show Bristol, Sunderland, and Leeds. Okay, we'll show Bristol, Sunderland, and Leeds in today's episode, guys. Don't go anywhere, and I'll be right back. Okay, so welcome back to the uh, game. You'll see that we have Bristol away in the League Cup, which we'll be playing in a moment. Obviously, it's a local derby, seven-side derby. But a few things to talk about before we actually continue. First of all, Aaron Gunnison has now been sold. We agreed a deal to sell him for one thousand five hundred and twenty, uh, one thousand five hundred twenty pounds, um, which will. Which has got basically he's gone to Huddersfield. I can't remember the team man. He's gone to Huddersfield and the board have allocated me 1.1 million. We'll take that. Because like I said, I, I wasn't gonna use him much. We've got lots and lots of options in midfield, so happy to get rid of him. Now, as far as the fixtures have gone, how have we done? I wanted to test out the simulation to see how it sort of went for us. Basically, if I can just get my calendar back again, you'll see for yourselves. We won against Fulham 1-0, but then we lost to Preston 2-0 away from home. And then we also lost 2-1 uh, to Sheffield Wednesday as well, unfortunately. But now we have a League Cup game, then Sunderland, then Leeds. So let's crack on with it, guys. Oh, shit. That's a free kick early on here for Bristol City. Morrison with the foul. What can Bristol do here today? That's actually a yellow card, really. Really, referee. Two minutes in and Sean Morrison's been booked already. What is this game? Look at this. Is this really a yellow card? Well, okay, he didn't get the ball, but come on. That early in the game, that's ridiculous. 
Okay, so they have the free kick here. Hopefully they don't score off it. Puts it in. And oh, this gone wide, but they did get a chance. First chance of the game goes to Bristol. Oh, it's a beautiful ball. What a run by Kadeem Harris. Back post. Oh, and it's in. 1-0 to Cardiff. Wonderful goal. It's Joe Rawls, who's come into the team for Lee Tomlin today. And he puts the Bluebirds 1-0 up with a fantastic volley. Kadeem Harris on the right-hand side. Lovely ball to the back stick. And there he was with the volley. Oh, lovely play. Beautiful, beautiful football by Cardiff. And they're 2-0 up. What a finish by Kenneth Sahal there. Fantastic finish. Very clinical in front of goal. That's probably the best goal we've scored this career mode so far, guys. What a finish that was by him. And in a derby as well, and in the cup of all places. Look at that. Rolls, Zahor, Sessing Young, the highlight, and then back in for Zahor, and he finishes it beautifully. Oh, he could be in you. Wood Woodburn. Woodburn! Yes! <laughs> 3 0. He came on as a sub for Kenneth the whole Ben Woodburn. And the youngsters finished beautifully. Look at that pace. He just wanted it more. Got in front of him. And look at that little dink over the keeper. A little dink to make it 3 0. And to take us through to the next round of the League Cup. Absolutely beautiful from the player on loan from Liverpool. Oh, Bristol playing well here. Good football by Bristol. Oh, I've lost it. And he saved it. Bloody hell, they could have scored then. Oh, it's gone all the way through. Oh, I can't get it. Oh, I've been deflected. And we've just about held on there. What on earth was that? Maybe we can hit them on the break. Lots and lots of room. We've got the freedom of Ashton Gate by here. Oh, it's good defending just to get back. And again, a beautiful ball by Adam Clayton. Woodburn could be in. Back heel. And a volley. And a chance. Oh, it's in. 4 0. <laughs> junior, Junior Hoylet has made it 4 0. Woodburn, little back heel. Bang. And then in off the underside of the crossbar. We'll take that. We'll definitely take that. Fantastic result for Cardiff. Okay, so welcome back. So now we're going to have a away trip to the Stadium of Light. I'll see you in a moment, guys. So, Mendes Lang. Oh, Mendes Lang. Nearly straight away. Look for Mendes Lang. Could come free for Haidara. Oh, Haidara hits the crossbar. Oh, shit, he's left his marker. He could be in Aiden McGeady. Bamba's got him. Mendes Lang. Mendes Lang. So ho. Woodburn. Cardiff have done it. Up the other end. And Ben Woodburn's done it. Good ball. Mendes Lang. So ho. Woodburn! He's done here again, Ben Woodburn. And Cardiff are winning 2 0. Chance, Mendes Lang! Oh, he saved it straight at the depth. What a save for the keeper. Well, that was a fantastic win at Sunland for us. Ben Woodburn on scintillating form and what I've decided is the Leeds game it's a big game in this division so we will have that in the very next episode um, as a special feature okay guys I've been Dragonheart the Prince of Wales thank you for watching until next time goodbye